in Iowa. Your campaign is based around the idea you're a winner. Does that mean you have to win Iowa? No, I don't have to win it. And right now you and I are sitting in New Hampshire. And as you know, I have a very substantial lead in New Hampshire. But I think it would be really good to win Iowa. I'd like to win Iowa. I'm doing really well with the evangelicals and uh, in Iowa. But I'm also doing tremendously well all over the country with the evangelicals. I'm leading by a lot. Uh, doing great with the Tea Party. I'm doing well with all groups. I now have a fairly substantial lead in Iowa. I think we have a good chance of winning Iowa. I'd like to. Weeks ago, it was tighter in Iowa. Now you're ahead by a little more. Why do you think that is? Well, I think that Ted Cruz has been severely affected by uh, the Goldman Sachs loans, which he didn't disclose, and it was on his personal financial form, and the Citibank loans he didn't disclose. Couldn't that have just been a mistake? No, uh, it could have been, but it's, you know, two loans, give me a break, okay? And he's supposed to be Robin Hood for everybody. He didn't disclose them because he didn't want to say that he's dealing with the bankers. Don't forget, he said he sold his assets. But I think much more important is this whole fact that he was born in Canada. And he was a citizen of Canada until 15 months ago. And there is much law right now, and a lot of constitutional lawyers are coming out. Lawrence Tribe is uh, sort of middle ground. In other words, he says it's untested. But there are many lawyers coming out, top constitutional lawyers, that Ted Cruz cannot run for president. He can't be president because of the fact he was born in Canada.